Alright guys, so this is my review of Suicide Squad. So, the movie all around was okay. Story wasn't super great, but I mean, given what DC has put out lately, since the last five or six years, you know, it was one of the better movies, but they really just haven't caught on like Marvel has with the uh, whole storytelling aspect of the movies. Um, the one thing everybody loved about the movie was, uh, what's her name? Harley Quinn, you know, gorgeous in the movie despite the bleached skin. Um, my one big issue with the movie was the fact that, I mean, besides, uh, Harley Quinn, Margot Robbie, you really didn't know a lot of those characters if you're not into comic books. I mean, Killer Croc you might have heard of, but everybody else was really a B-list villain. And so, it's just, unless you know it, it's not something you're going to get into. But, you know, I knew a little bit of it. My friends I was watching it with, they uh, they knew a little bit, so they enjoyed it. But it's just kind of like, it was like throwing Guardians of the Galaxy out there. But with that one, Marvel actually went ahead and killed it. DC, on the other hand, with Suicide Squad, just wasn't able to pull it off, and they haven't yet. I haven't seen any of their movies since their whole announcement of, you know, this through 2020 that they've going to produce, and none of them have been that great. Batman v Superman was alright, but still not that great. And Jared Leto in the movie, that was, I mean, the Joker, it was an interesting take on the Joker, but I feel that Jared Leto in the movie thought that he was going to be more of a star of the movie than he really was. And so it just didn't flow well. I think if they make a sequel to it and involve Jared Leto as the Joker, then perhaps maybe 